been relegated to the back of the van again. So we've got Molly, Vin's old bitch, we've got Doris. I still look at her as a, as a pup, to be honest with you. I mean, Tommy's new pup. This is uh, Bonnie. 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 And then we've got Jem. My bitch. So plenty of ammo today. I thought you weren't saying ferrets, they're just not ferrets. Good tell you about this, we don't have to kill you. They're not stones, they are rabbits. And apparently we're leaving them once. Well guys, I'm back out ferreting with Tomo and Vin again. And this time I'm excited as I have my young lurcher bitch with me. We're going to be bolting again to the dogs. And this, is, this is far more enjoyable watching the dogs run the rabbits. And it also gives the rabbits a sporting chance of escaping. Uh, but I'm confident Jen will make a few catches yeah, and this will be great for her confidence she's building. She's after it. There she goes. There's Jen. The views are absolutely stunning from up here on the hills. Breathtaking would be a better way of putting it and uh, whilst we get our breaths back we're going to try our luck ferreting these steep banks. Go on Tomo. Come on. Oh, Jen's got a, giving a mark here. Vin parrot in that one. I'll tell my bitches. Just missed that one. Vin bought with that rabbit and it's gone straight over my warren. Yes, I'm very pleased with that catch from Jem. However, I'm thankful that Doris was around to retrieve it back up that steep bank. I didn't fancy going down there collecting it myself. Even when the rabbits do begin to bolt, there's just too many holes and the rabbits are running from one to the other. Not only that, the bankings are steep and Jem just can't get on terms. So it looks like Vin had the right idea to move away from the bankings because in the same amount of time I've only caught one more rabbit he tells us he caught several without a miss The plan is to gut the catch and leave the rabbits for collecting later and then move on to some easier warrens. We need to wait for my polecat jewel ferret first, as she seems to be after another rabbit. Well that's got in, we've missed him as well. So as we move over to the next lot of warrens, <laughs> we're gonna let the dogs work the sedge grass. But before that, Gem has to negotiate jumping a stone wall for the first time. This she does with confidence. Mm. 
Molly, Doris and even young Bonnie try and sniff out the rabbits. But Jem doesn't drift too far away from her. Soon the energy lifts and I start to anticipate some action. As I was expecting, a rabbit bolts for it. It was a fine catch and even finer to hear Tomo and Vin praising Jem. We eventually reached the warrens we were after and we could see one hell of a lot of rabbits above ground. But these rabbits are more difficult to catch than I was expecting. Look how this rabbit goes straight through this wall, leaving Jem astonished. Even when given half a chance, Jem still can't get within striking range. I've only caught three rabbits so far, plus we're running out of time. Another rabbit makes a run for it over the brow of the hill. Good girl, come on then, come on then. And thankfully Jem caught me that rabbit. However, without sounding too greedy, I just wanted to catch a few more. But then again, so did Jem. More rabbits start bolting and Jem pulls off some heroic catches. She accelerates so much into the strike, it sends her tumbling with her catch. So from watching Jem ferreting today, it's pretty obvious she's confident with her striking. She's got a good change of speed already and can turn tight on her rabbit. But for some reason she stopped retrieving and I will have to work on this throughout the summer. But all in all I'm very happy with her and uh, you can tell she's going to be a good hunting companion. I would just like to thank Tomo and Vin for inviting me onto their permission again for the second time. I wish I could have seen more of their dogs working and filmed it. But instead, I've enjoyed watching my own bitch work along with my ferrets. Unfortunately, I did lose some footage of Jem's final catches. But the final tally of the day was 49 rabbits and Jem caught me 12 of those, which wasn't bad after all, after such a slow start. Well thanks again, thanks for watching and roll on next season.